In the annals of cybersecurity, few incidents have left as indelible a mark as the 2015 breach of the Office of Personnel Management, OPM, a devastating attack that exposed the sensitive personal information of millions of federal employees and contractors. This audacious cyber assault, widely attributed to state-sponsored actors linked to China, shook the foundations of the U.S. government and served as a stark wake-up call to the vulnerabilities that lay within the nation's digital infrastructure. The sheer scale of the OPM breach was staggering. As the agency responsible for managing the federal government's civilian workforce, the OPM housed a treasure trove of sensitive data, including personnel records, security clearance details, and background investigation files. In the aftermath of the attack, it was revealed that the personal information of over 22 million current and former federal employees had been compromised, a staggering figure that underscored the gravity of the situation. As former Director of National Intelligence James Clapper grimly observed, the OPM breach was a tremendous gift to the Chinese intelligence services, providing them with a wealth of information about the lives and backgrounds of millions of Americans involved in government service. One, this sentiment was echoed by cybersecurity experts and government officials alike, who recognized the far-reaching implications of such a massive data breach. The consequences of the OPM attack were swift and severe. In addition to the immediate financial and logistical costs associated with responding to the breach, the incident dealt a significant blow to public trust in the government's ability to safeguard sensitive information. As former OPM director Catherine Archuleta acknowledged, the breach eroded the trust and confidence that the American people had in their government and in the ability of the government to protect their personal information. Moreover, the OPM breach highlighted the urgent need for a comprehensive overhaul of the government's cybersecurity posture. In the wake of the attack, the Obama administration launched a series of initiatives aimed at bolstering the nation's digital defenses, including the establishment of the Cybersecurity National Action Plan and the creation of the position of Federal Chief Information Security Officer. But the ripple effects of the OPM breach extended far beyond the confines of the federal government. The incident served as a sobering reminder of the vulnerabilities that exist within the digital ecosystems of organizations across all sectors, prompting a renewed focus on cybersecurity best practices and the implementation of robust security measures. As we reflect on the aftermath of the OPM breach, two critical questions emerge. How can we foster a culture of cybersecurity awareness and vigilance within organizations? ensuring that every employee from the frontline worker to the executive suite understands the importance of safeguarding sensitive data and adhering to best practices? In an era of increasingly sophisticated cyber threats, how can we strike the delicate balance between maintaining open and accessible digital systems and implementing robust security measures to protect against malicious actors? These questions and the lessons learned from the OPM breach have profound implications for the future of cybersecurity. As we navigate the ever-evolving landscape of digital threats, it is imperative that we remain proactive, adaptable, and unwavering in our commitment to protecting the integrity of our digital infrastructure. One thing is certain, the OPM breach was a watershed moment, a wake-up call that reverberated throughout the cybersecurity community and beyond. It served as a stark reminder of the high stakes at play in the digital realm and the urgent need for a coordinated, comprehensive approach to cybersecurity. As we look to the future, it is incumbent upon us to learn from the mistakes of the past and to embrace a new paradigm of cybersecurity, one that prioritizes resilience, collaboration, and a deep understanding of the evolving threat landscape. Only by doing so can we hope to create a more secure and resilient digital ecosystem one that is capable of withstanding the challenges of the 21st century and beyond. For in the end, the OPM breach was not merely a isolated incident, but rather a harbinger of the challenges that lie ahead. It was a clarion call for action, a reminder that complacency and inaction in the face of cyber threats are simply not an option. As we move forward, we must do so with a renewed sense of urgency and a steadfast commitment to protecting the digital foundations upon which our modern society rests.